Okay, guys, here at the uh, All Guitar Network for the Vintage Guitar Minute. And this guitar, it's kind of a funny case here, a little brown case, uh, 57 gold top. Really cool guitar, total mojoed out, plays and sounds great. Small frets, nickel parts, PAFs, ABR1. Um, really cool. It's also the dark back. You know, they made a light back and a dark back. This is a dark back, 1957. Just a beautiful and an incredible sounding guitar. Um, one of the coolest vintage guitars. There's a very small repair on this guitar on the back of the head, and we black lit it, and we can't really see what's going on, but I know something was done there, but uh, it's minuscule, and it's uh, not evident. But look at that. Totally vibed out. This over here is a very cool guitar. You know, we, we're kind of known for really clean guitars, but sometimes we get some of these vibey. This is a 66. It has been refretted. These are repro tuners, but they're aged repro tuners. Everything else, the pickups are all right. It is original finish. Um, there's a couple wires that were changed, but a really cool guitar. Just totally vibed out. Plays and sounds about as good as it can get. Perfect amount of wear on the neck. Just feels fantastic. Sounds great. Somebody's going to get a great guitar with this one. And by the way, it does have the original hang tags in there too. It has a five-way switch, but there's the original three-way. Is another one out of the warehouse, and this thing is beautiful. This is a 1960 ES330. I'm really partial to these guitars. This is beautiful. It's going to a friend of mine named Peter, and he's a lucky guy because it's a great guitar, super clean. Never had a strap button on there. Just one of the nicer 2P90s dot inlay, original knobs, and yellowed out tip. It's just everything you would want in the ES330. It's like the Grant Green Special. Pretty cool original brown case. All right, guys, so this one's rather terrifying. This is a 60 ES345 in just crazy clean condition, flamed, beautiful, um, hardly worn, um, stunning, and has original brown case with original receipt, original stereo cord, some of the original uh, tags, I think the tunematic tag and all that with it. This is uh, an amazing example. So, you know, the difference on the 335s, the 345s, the 335 has a little bit less binding. It has, so you know, the nickel parts. This is gold hardware. This guitar looks like it's hardly ever been played. Um, you know, it has a crown up there. This is stereo with a varitone. Um, again, the original knobs, tip. This is a closet classic if there ever was one. And a beautiful brown case. And uh, if you like 345s, man, this is the one. All right, so this guitar here is an ES. 125 TDC. It's like the George Thorogood guitar, but a hardly played one. I think this one is a 1964, and it's in stunning condition. It's a thin body. It has the hang tags, by the way, in the case, and the original strap. And this is the original alligator case. Crazy clean condition. Brazilian rosewood fingerboard. Um, you can kind of really see the really nice grain on this fingerboard on this. It's a hardly played variety. Cherry Sunburst, uh, George Thorogood's is pretty hammered. This one is like first month of production for, you know, in condition wise. I mean, it's just as clean as can be. Great sounding guitar. And I have two of these that are almost exactly the same. One is a 63 and that is a 64. And uh, 
I'm holding the 63 from my friend David Hidalgo from Los Lobos, uh, but this one's still available. So just to let you know, great example. So this guitar here is based on the uh, Larson Brothers guitars. Huge guitar. I don't know if this is like 20 inches or what it is. Um, it's uh, by Tony Klassen and um, beautiful rosewood, just gigantic body, really cool tuners, uh, very similar to the old Guild tuners that they used. Um, amazing, uh, terrific guitar that Pearl jumps off this sunburst finish. Uh, it's called the Arc New Era and it's handmade by Tony Klassen and it's American made and it's got a pickup in it. It's a really cool guitar um, and kind of striking for sure.